pulling music for Tolerable David, I wanted to give the audience a taste of what it would have been like in 1921 to have been at a screening of Tolerable David. Uh, the music is all drawn from uh, music that would have been widely available, stock music for silent movies, and uh, put together like a local pianist that uh, your movie house would have done. Uh, of course, in a bigger city, you'd have an orchestra, but uh, we we're pretending we're in a smaller town with just the piano. Favorite part of Tolable David, I noticed the, the mothers uh, or, or, or the women uh, uh, brushing away flies from over the dinner table with some shredded up newspaper on a stick. Something that, that it, it, uh, it helps connect us as an audience member into the heat. And you, you, don't, you can't really show the flies on screen, but you think about that and, and, and just sort of the general everyday grime. And it makes the people very real and human and the food fresh. And, and they, they all, they, they come out of the screen and, and become real. In Never Weaken, because I, 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 I also play the harp, so I have to say, it's, there's, a, there's a moment with a harpist on screen, so it's, it, it always uh, catches my eye. But what's so wonderful is, uh, it, it's a wonderful bait and switch that uh, Harold Lloyd has set up because you're looking at the harp and, and you're totally distracted by it and then there's a wonderful gag which you'll have to watch the film to get. It's a wonderful setup and, and a wonderful bait and switch and uh, I think the audience tonight would be curious to see how they, how they respond to it but it's a, it's a wonderful musical gag too which is great because it's a silent movie but it's a music gag so you couldn't ask for more. <laughs>